welcome to San Diego Comic Con day two. We are at our favorite booth. We're at the Pac Man booth with Pac Man Museum Plus. Justin, tell us about Pac Man Museum Plus. Sure. It comes from our friends Bandai Namco Entertainment, and this game will be available Q1 of 2022, available on all platforms. And uh, I'm excited for it. Yeah, just recently announced that San Diego Comic Con that they were going to be coming out. Of course, Pac Man got inducted into the museum. The, oh my gosh. The San Diego Comic Con museum uh, just this week. Yes. And uh, he's joining uh, like Halo and all these other cool things. Right, so, uh, right. And that museum uh, display will be available for a whole year. So if you're in the San Diego area, be sure to check that out. Yeah, they have a lot of cool stuff. They have a lot of like retro game, re retro like uh, like lunch boxes and cool little memorabilia uh, from all over the era, from '82 on. Yeah. Uh, actually, from '80 on. Uh, sure. So you can check all of that out. <laughs> Pac-Man's older than almost 40, as old as we Yeah, are. 41 years old, 1980, yeah. Yeah, he's an Crazy. old man. Did you have any Pac-Man toys when you were a kid? I had a lot of Pac-Man toys. The thing I remember the most, I had a wind-up Pac-Man. And uh, and he like did this little thing. Yeah, yeah, he went he went across and he made like the scene. Like one of those old <laughs> wind-up toys he used sure. to make. And it was so sure. much fun. I remember dumping so many quarters in a Pac-Man. I remember uh, my dad taught me how to play Pac-Man and Miss Pac-Man to... to Going for the ghost is a sucker's game. You yeah. Know, you don't avoid. want the high score. You want to go for all the boards. So while they're blue, you get all the dots. Right. Patience is the name of the game. Yeah. So I don't know if you play Pac-Man 99. Uh, I love it. Uh, but I've never won. I've only gotten like top two. But my strategy has worked well where I right. just ignore the ghost. I get the power pellet. <laughs> I use that opportunity to eat all the other pellets. Right. And just leave the ghost alone. I'm not a violent guy. You're not. I am. I'm like, uh, I go crazy town banana pants. Yeah, for I the, want all the ghosts. Ghosts. Yeah, I'm a chompy chompy. And I got, I think I got second before you did in Pac-Man 99. You did. And that let a, uh, let a, a fire under you. You're yeah. like, oh, I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. But neither one of us have won the Pac-Man 99. So I'm very excited to try out Pac-Man Museum Plus. But since you got it first, that means you're higher on the leaderboard than sure. me. Because you I'll, got I'll second first. So now it's a race to see who get a first first. Sure. I actually had Miss Pac-Man on Atari 2600. That nice. was really cool. That was my first Pac-Man memory. Very awesome. excited about that. Yeah, I remember having the NES like uh, like Tengen version, like not like the official like gray cards. Right. But it was like one of those like like the black cards that sure. like, <laughs> like all bootleggy. Like it wasn't square on the front; it was kind of angled on the front, yeah. so it looked all funny. Got um, out of a guy's trunk. Yeah. Yeah. In the uh, parking lot. <laughs> yeah, but that's you know, Comic Con. We're doing this amazing giveaway for uh, some really cool Pac-Man stuff. We're giving away a Pac-Man arcade one-up machine, uh, a limited edition Xbox, uh, and a ton of Nano blocks. So you just got to go to bluefinbrands.com slash contest to enter. Uh, Guess how many nano blocks it took to put this two foot Pac Man together? Uh, and the number might surprise you, but we can't tell you until Monday or Tuesday when we select our winner. Right. And very excited. And we'll announce the winner on Friday, whatever day that is. Uh, I don't know. Probably like what, the second or third. I should have kept my mouth shut on that one. So yeah. Next Friday. Yeah, next Friday. First, is, second, third, or fourth. Whatever, whatever that, that first is. Friday is in December, that will be the day <laughs> we'll we announce. We'll figure it out then. Yeah. Uh, so should we play? Yeah, go for it. All, All right. I'll. I'll comment. You can double. I can, I can be the, the commentary. Uh, all right. Let's see. Let's see how we got. Are you excited? I'm super excited. I love Pac-Man. This is one of those things where I if you know, die in the game, you die in real life. I just know that I'm going to do poorly because everyone's watching. Right. I think you're going to be amazing. I, I hope you're right. I have faith in you. You are number two in the world in Pac-Man 99. Win compared to just the two. <laughs> oh, this one looks angry. I can do this. One. I think this is like a trial. You would have oh, just died. This is the real version. It's Are you sure? Trial. It's not like a demo. I, I feel like it's a demo. <laughs> I can eat the computer. Oh, that one. See, easy peasy. Look how good I am. Yeah, I think it's. I think it's a trial. No, no, yeah. I'm just that good. <laughs> this is round two. Maybe it's in demo mode and you're always going to no. win. <laughs> uh -uh. Is that possible? That's not possible. How come it kicks you away like that? I don't know. That's shenanigans. He wanted, he wanted to like kiss, but then he like, he like, he like had second thoughts about it. Uh-oh. Remember, the pellet. ghost or a sucker game. You're, you're rocking and rolling. Yeah. Oh, I'm going to get the cherry. That's Everybody a loves the cherry. Was it a peach? Yeah. Colorblinds. That's okay. Oh, oh. see, I almost went you were for the flirting ghost. with disaster. I told you there. it's a sucker's game. Candy. It's gonna keep. I'm gonna keep them blue. Yeah, I'm rocking and rolling, man. The blue ones. Banana. 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 There we go. That was the. This orange. computer getting, player is not good. It's getting dicey. Yeah, I was gonna say you might want to take care of some of those ghosts. They're getting faster and faster. They are. Okay. 
Cue yeah. the cue the boss music. It's getting intense. Whoa, you like tricked me out there. <laughs> I wasn't prepared to the top. It's stressing me out. Get so it's, it's kind of like Pac-Man '99, if you know, to where once you get the fruit, uh, it resets the board. Right. Oh no. Oh, it made a weird. It's like. What happened? I don't know. I did so good. I got one. I'm impressed. See, that's how good I am. Do you want to play? No. All right. <laughs> Let me just pause it here. I can't. I cannot exceed your greatness. Let's see. All right. Okay. I think I'm playing against somebody. So cool. there I go. So yeah, ton of fun as you can see. Even I could beat it. So if I can do it, Justin you can, can do it. it. You can. I don't know if I can do it. Yeah. I retired champion long ago. When you got number, second. You got second on Pac-Man 99. <laughs> I am the ultimate second plays player. <laughs> what you got like act one in like the first Pac-Man? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Totally. I'm nice. an intercontinental champion. Yeah, so, so if you're at San Diego Comic Con, come to booth 2204. Uh, they're doing demos. If you do the demo, you get a cool little Pac-Man lanyard Ooh. for your uh, for your badge. Uh, super cool. Everyone's been asking me where I got it, so come to booth 2204 to play the Pac-Man game. Uh, lots of people here. They're showing you. They're teaching you. If you're not a pro like I am, have you seen a Pac-Man cosplayer yet? I haven't. I haven't either. I could be Pac-Man cosplay. You can. It's like the one cosplay I can do. <laughs> I can be the little ghosty and run. Oh, I'll just chase you. Yeah. And like behind you on like a like a wire, you'll have like a power pelt that like glows. Yeah, that's the way to do it. Ooh, I like I like where we're going with this. Yeah. Uh, uh, do you want to take a look around the Let's booth? take a look around. Randy, are you ready to look around? All right. All right. All right so let's go, go over way. here. Go behind the velvet ropes over here. Pardon us. You can hear us. All right. I'm gonna hold the gate open for this uh Rolling monstrosity that Randy has created. <laughs> Whoa. Spinny, Thank you, guys. Spinny, spinny. All right. So we're wheeling. Wheeling right. and or dealing. So let's take a look Watch. at this amazing Pac-Man statue from Nanoblock. This thing is gorgeous. Uh, we have a guessing game going on right now. If you can guess how many Nanoblocks are in this gorgeous statue, then you will be able to be eligible to win the incredible grand prize, which is, of course, an arcade one-up machine for a Pac-Man. There is, of course, this very limited Xbox console. Uh, there's very few in the world, and you will be a part of an exclusive club if you get your hands on that thing. Uh, attendees here just got to scan the QR code, but if you're watching from home, all you got to do is go to bluefinbrands.com slash contest and then put in what you think is the right answer. Just by playing also gets you as a chance to win uh, one of our special prizes, which is also an arcade one-up Pac-Man machine. So even if you guess wrong, it doesn't even matter. You can still randomly be selected to win an arcade machine. Absolutely. I guessed, and I was way off. I know the answer, <laughs> and I wasn't even close in my guess. Uh, so, uh, you know, uh, dream high, boys and girls. Yes. <laughs> but this thing's amazing. It weighs a billion pounds. Uh, it's about two feet wide, two feet tall. It's, uh, it's a monster. Yeah, if you follow at Nanoblock US, uh, that's the social channels, you can see just how tiny nanoblocks are, if you don't know off the top of your head how yeah. tiny they are. About four millimeters. Yeah, four millimeters. So... You know, you can do the math here. You know, this is probably a little over two feet, round two feet. Uh, you know, we're talking four millimeters. We're converting. There's a lot of variables in your math metric. right now. <laughs> about, I, about, about. <laughs> I watched someone for like 45 minutes try to count the layers. And I remember he had to do it like three times. He had someone with him and just kept talking. Oh, man. Uh, it didn't look like he was having a good time, but uh, just throw out a guess. Yeah. You know? So it's a really fun contest. It's running uh, through Monday at noon. So you have time if you haven't entered already. So be sure to do that. There's some daily entries that you can do. So you can increase your chances on winning. Yeah, and yeah, I mean, who doesn't want a Pac-Man arcade machine? Justin already has one. I do. It's a legacy machine. It's incredible. It's got like 12 games on it. It's a lot of fun, and one could be yours. Yeah. So very not, excited about can, that. Can I win? You are not eligible. Dang it. Void where prohibited. That is no fun Plus, at all. you know the answer. <laughs> That's true. You know the answer. I guess that is not fair. Right. So um, people in attendance can definitely just scan the QR code, have a good time. They have a little bit of an edge on you. But if you look at the graphics, you can see uh, when you're when you go to blueprintbrands.com slash contest, you will see an illustration that shows it to scale on a six foot tall human being. I almost feel like being here gives you an, a disadvantage because you think you're going to game the system by like counting the rows. Right. You're going to be doing all this math and stuff like that. <laughs> it's not not going to work out. You're just going to overthink it. Just, really? just, just use your instinct. Just on this guess. One. Yeah. Just look at it and be like, yeah, that's like 11 trillion blocks. Sure. So Pac-Man has an incredible presence here. We have uh, items on display from Bandai Hobby, from uh, Tamashii Nations. There's some really cool stuff to check out. Uh, we'll show you here in a minute. Uh, but very excited about what Pac-Man brings to the table, including uh, convention-exclusive uh, Pac-Man from Nanoblox. And what's really cool about it is we'll take a walk over here in a second. Uh, but it is one of the only items in this entire convention that has the San Diego Comic-Con Special Edition logo on the box. 
Yes. On the box. On Dave. the box. <laughs> on the blade. Right. This this is a very special event. It's a clear, transparent plastic. It looks really cool. Very excited about it. So why don't we just take a 180 and go check out that exclusive? Can we appreciate like the Aaron Sorkin of this? Like I feel like I'm on the ER, ER the West Wing. Yeah. Like, I need we're, like, 20 talking. CCs. Like we're two people just talking while they got this dolly shot behind us. We got we got these we got extras. It looks like an Aaron Sorkin show right here. And we got Bryce. And he's, we got Bryce. He's on the phone. Hey, so he's important. Hey guys, <laughs> this is Bryce. Bryce, say hi. Say hi. Hey, what's up, everybody? How's it going? Bryce didn't know he was going to be on the show. You having a great? Are you having a great convention? Uh, I'm yes, having a wonderful convention full of Pac-Man, full of these nano blocks. It's been it's been a blast. Yeah. I bet I bet you rather I just left you alone. Uh no, man. Like I'm a I'm a ham for the ca uh, oh, awesome. the camera. Well, why don't yeah. you tell us about the uh, NanoBlock exclusive? Uh, so the NanoBlock exclusive you can only purchase here at the special edition of the San Diego Comic Con. It comes with uh, quite a few little figurines here. We got the Pac-Man arcade, as we see on this wonderful little uh, spinning contraption. You know, like uh, technology is really <laughs> made it to a, 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 a fine position here in 2021. Uh, along with that, uh, we got obviously the adorable little. Pac-Man here, a couple of our ghosts. I'm totally blanking out on their oh, names. Inky Ooh. and Blinky. Blinky. Inky and Blinky, of course. Of course, how could I forget that? That was a <laughs> test. You passed. <laughs> and uh, yeah, the wonderful little fruit there. But yeah, of course, you can only get this limited edition, exclusive Pac-Man nanoblock set here. So I don't know what you guys are doing. Get on over here. Go get, go get the tickets. As you can <laughs> see, on the box. Consume. Consume. <laughs> Awesome. Thank you, Bryce. Sorry to just ambush no. you there. You were there. I'm like, oh, I'm going to talk to Bryce. Gotcha journalism yeah, right gotcha there. journalism. What's in your, what's in your wallet? We're on you. Yeah. So, yeah, like Bryce said, this is an amazing contraption. Um, I do love the turntables. We're like halfway yeah. to back. we got one turntable and a microphone. That lazy Susan's not so lazy anymore. She's no, rocking and rolling. It's like solar powered. I don't right. know it's working inside. I know. It's super light. It's no solar. <laughs> Yeah. No, very excited about it. And you can see how, like, uh, just com size comparison, that whole nanoblock display that was over there of the Pac-Man versus, you know, the arcade machine or even that little version of the Pac-Man. They are adorable. Uh, any, most of them range from about one inch to three inches tall. Uh, just depends what you're getting. But uh, this is an incredible value here. It's basically three different nanoblock sets. Yeah, and you can see with the, they're, just, they're not just decoration. They're a little, uh, they give you a size of scale of the little pieces. So these are the types of blocks that are making that huge Pac-Man over there. So it's, it's a lot uh, to take in. It's a, it is a lot. I don't know how they do it, but uh, yeah, it's great. So yeah, if you're at the convention, make sure to come to booth 2204. Check out everything in the Pac-Man booth. It's right across from the Bluepin booth, right across from G-Base. Where Bandai has a nice little corner here. Where we have all of our booths. Uh, you know, Studio Ghibli is here. They got so many cool things over at Studio Ghibli. Uh, we're giving away a free no face mask. Uh, we have, uh, if you uh, do a certain amount of purchase, you get a free tote bag. I think it's $30. $30. Studio Ghibli stuff. Yeah. You get this really cool uh, Ghibli tote bag. We have get a, a selfie with Totoro. Yeah, we have a on. giant Totoro over there. He's bigger than Dave, for crying out loud. He, like, oh. he would be the little spoon if they spooned in oh, the Betty Bar. Can you imagine how warm and cuddly that spoon <laughs> is, though? I can Totoro. imagine. I can imagine. I could get in on that. Oh, oh man, man, look at that. Doing it live. Yeah, and then, of course, Nanoblocks has a ton of stuff over there from Pokemon. Uh, you know, from Dragon Ball, you know, even stuff that's like food and stuff like that. Sure. So many cool uh, nanoblock things. Ultraman, Mazinger, it's Dragon just, Ball, Pokemon, his whole Pokemon wall. Nanoblock has got everything figured out. Yeah. So including Pac-Man. <laughs> yeah. So make sure you're following Apple and brands across all social platforms. That's the best way to keep up with everything going on San Diego Comic-Con. Justin and AJ and the rest of their team have just been tweeting up a storm, uh, posting stuff on Instagram, making sure that you guys, if you're not here, you can experience everything that's going on at San Diego Comic-Con. And uh, anything else, Justin? That is it. Just remember to enter the contest at bluefinbrands.com slash contest. The contest is going through noon on Monday. So be sure to enter to win incredible prizes. Who doesn't want an arcade Pac-Man machine? I desperately want one. And I'm going to I have to get one. I have to pay for it. You do. <laughs> what's, the, what's the benefit of working for Bandai? You are not eligible. <laughs> I know, right? The simple thing. And then it's like with like my like uh, my benefits. Right. Who I get, needs? I them? get sick days. I get vacation days. I get a free arcade. Machine. You should have arcade days as well. Yeah. So. All right. Well, well cool. Uh, like I said, if you're here, come to Booth 2204. It's the Pac-Man booth right across from our booth, and we'd love to see you. Make sure to stop by, say hi. We got a box of goodies, and uh, until next time, we'll see you 
Tomorrow at noon, we're going to be broadcasting from the Bluefin booth. We're going to give you a full tour. A whole grand tour yeah. of all that we brought to the table. And it's make sure to go to our YouTube page, which is Bluefin Video. We got a ton of videos going up there that's going to show a lot of cool interviews we did and a lot of cool stuff. So And other booth tours and walkthroughs. Yeah, walkthroughs. Check it out. I'm walking here. I'm, I'm walking, walking here. here. I'm walking. Yeah. So everyone have a fantastic day. Hope everyone stays safe. And if you're at San Diego, make sure you come by and say hi. So see you guys later. Thank you so much. You're the best. You're the best. You. you. I'm going to take it. I'm going to take right. the compliment. <laughs>